Yeah, we are recording. So, <laughs> welcome! <laughs> Wait, I forgot, did we decide who was getting what? You want to burn it? No, did you want to burn it? No, I'm playing it, but did you want to edit it? Oh, did you edit it? No, I'm not. Okay, we got this. I thought we decided this. Yeah, we did. Okay, you want to discuss it. So I'm taking Burning Rangers. What's up, guys? We're playing Burning Rangers. Yeah, oh, yeah, this is perfect. This is the level of shit that my video deserves. So we're playing. Oh, yeah, this is perfect. This is the level of shit that my video deserves. So we're playing. Wait, this is a theme song? Yes. And it plays in PSO2. Yeah, she sings the theme song. Did you hear that? I really like the music for it. We have to beat this all in one sitting, too. Yeah. Oh, boy. My, uh, I don't have another... What is this controller? I mean, did you want to switch off or something? Or no, I mean, uh, I'm just... No, this I mean, the first like, time I'm you die. Huh? I, I don't know. I, it depends on how much fun I have before I die. Alright. <laughs> so, this is Burning Rangers. So, Anthony, you're the one who showed me. Give me a quick run-through of what this game, what to expect. So, you're a firefighter from the future. Okay. <laughs> and you have to save the people in the fire, but you also have to put out the fire using your gun. So, <laughs> kind, of, so, so kind of think of like Mighty Switch Force, but without the high no, best theme song. Never, I thought you never played Mighty Switch Force. Exactly. Exactly. Switch Force. No, I keep telling you. Good game. Keep telling you it's a really good game. Yeah. Really good game. I gotta make that next. All right. Oh, I gotta choose number two because <laughs> number two. <laughs> just to be special. Sure. Right. Wait, do, do I have to? No. No. Too late, I'm doing it. Let's go! Yeah! Let's go! <laughs> do they have different faces on each other? Yes, they do. Oh, oh they do? I they just found out by now. Oh, 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 oh that's, that's awesome. awesome! Okay. Learning new lore as we play. Hey, look, you got mail. Also, the music's really good. Yeah, the music is really good. Hope we don't get blocked because of how hype this music is. <laughs> Rescue this. You haven't rescued anybody yet. Uh, I don't deserve to be in this point then. <laughs> so bring me back to the hype. There you go. Yeah. Okay, so it is jump. He is shot. It'll take he is through, shot. It'll take you through a mandatory tutorial too. Uh, okay. I I always like going through the options though. No, it's fair. Just like all the games. Yeah. Super Let's go. Oh. So we got Sho and Mabane. 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 No, you gotta, you gotta pick the next one. No. Yeah! Tillis! I like her. <laughs> I love her already. No! Who's the last one? No! Oh, it's only these two? Get that yeah. Kyoku! Oh no, you're right, yeah. It Get that Kyoku Sanagi looking <laughs> loser out of here. This guy? Look at him, he's like, Kyoku Sanagi! He's, so, he's not even like 90s neutral it's protagonist. Hand, it's just... That hand, it's... No, okay, no, no, that, actually, I'm not gonna lie. That little yo peace sign with his little burning knuckle kind of thing. It's kind of cool, uh, but no. The only thing cool about him is his jacket. No, everything. He's actually pretty aesthetically cool, but she's cool. She, yes, no, she, she. I do she's like, cool. I do like Tilsa style. I she, her name is just Tillis. Wait, hold on though. Like, what's up with her face? I'm talking about the, the actual model. Oh, oh that's what I'm gonna say. Face. The Facebook like is like, just take the picture. Uh, take, take the, the picture. Uh, picture. Uh, Hurry up. Uh, I've been uh, holding this for too long. Oh, thank God. <laughs> No, I'm just talking about the character model. Well, you can't see their faces in either one. Also true. Yeah. But yeah. But no, because that, that's how the designs work. Because like, if you see like the band, like it, it'll play for the spray. It's like, oh, you can't see his eyes anyway because the thing's too big. They can't render it. But it's fine because it's got a big metal thing on his face. <laughs> and for her, it's just her hair. So. I like her. She's cute. Oh, she was cool. Okay. Love her. <laughs> love her. I love her voice. It's good. This game features voice navigation. Please adjust the volume accordingly. Right. Is this really going to be a problem? No. Okay. Alright. Okay, are you ready? I'm going to take you through the basics. Mastering these techniques are critical to becoming a ranger. I'm Chris Barton, the leader of the Burning Rangers. Sex? Yes. And you're an advocate <laughs> for this exercise. Chris always monitors our situation and provides us with updates. Make sure you listen to her carefully. Because it may save your life. Press the navigation call button when you're lost, and I'll try to help you out. Hmm. This is Reed Phoenix. He'll be helping you with the basics. I read that as Z. 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 <laughs> <laughs> His age is he's asleep. He's, he's forever tired. <laughs> to look to your right. 
So I got to look to my right? Yeah. Oh, camera. Do you see that fuel tank? Well, that's a fuel tank. Now look to your left by pressing the L button. Now you should see a door. Use the L and the R buttons to rotate the camera, okay? Now let's begin. All right. Oh, I'm thinking, I can't rotate the camera. But <laughs> no, it's not that. Follow Reed. Use the oh, name's Reed. Reed Phoenix. But it said lead. Can you see that gap ahead? Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> You'll automatically clear small gaps. Follow me. Automatically? I don't know. Yeah, it's like the uh, Legend of Zelda, you automatically jump. You should be able to look around corners by pressing the L and R buttons. Ah. I like her backpack. The wings? The little jetpack backpack thing. Yeah, that's cool. It reminds me of Wing Gundam. This is very... Yeah, okay, so yeah, this is... This is this just like makes me want to... There are three different some. types of doors <laughs> and hatches that are striped and color coded. Yeah. yeah. This is where the fuse is going to be. You have three access to the doors. To open yellow stripe doors, you must find and activate a switch. Switches can often be found right next to the doors, but some may be located in different rooms. Red doors cannot be opened. Once they're closed, that's it. Also, you need to know that there are doors that only work in one direction. You can only enter the door from the blue stripe side. Well, that's ominous. Okay, okay. Next exercise. <laughs> well, who's this cool guy? I'd like to introduce you to Big Land Man. Big, big Land, Land Man! Man! <laughs> yeah! And you might have seen him. Why can't I pick him? <laughs> <laughs> a ranger can never be too careful. If you don't understand what I'm talking about, don't worry. That's a JoJo character! <laughs> it's Big Land Man! Now we'll show you how to do it. No, what's your real name? Big. You can jump up by pressing the jump button. If you press the jump button while in the air, your jetpack will deliver an extra boost that allows you to jump higher and get more distance. Uh -oh. Here, watch me, and you'll see what I mean. Like this. <laughs> I thought there was going to be a noise. <laughs> right? Like a... Uh... Like a jetpack sounding noise. Above and to your left. This thing is freaking now, big land man. How is he able to jump so high? Use the D-pad to locate him. Dude, man, big. Have you seen this man, big land man? He's a JoJo character. I saw him beginning of it yesterday. Oh, okay. All right, found him. So now can I move? No. Yeah, you won't let me move. Oh, you have to hit the Q button. I have to hit the what? The U button. Y button. And then no. look, and look around. I did, and I found him. He's right there. Can you see him? Yeah. Oh my god, I gotta okay. get it just right. Jump onto the platform where Big is standing. And the cat. Oh. You, can't oh, just, the whole you thing. can't just simply go up to it. You gotta you gotta go around it. Yeah, man. You gotta do what he did. Take he still does make a noise when he jump pad. Do you like Take that? it easy. You can do it. Do you like that popping too? Big, yeah. big, big land man believes in me. Oh. How did you? How did you? <laughs> Come on, George. <laughs> it's, it's Green Forest. It's not Green Forest. Oh my goodness, George. <laughs> you gotta what? do a double jump. I thought I did. No, you did. Oh, okay. No, you just straight up. He did it in one j j jump. But are you big land man? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> no, you're cute Tillis, and I like her. Also, you're getting time for this. By the way? Yeah, it doesn't affect it's trying training, so you'll be fine. Yeah, whatever. Oh! <laughs> whoa, whoa, oh, 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 oh! Yeah! So can uh, Big Land Man do that? No. Oh, uh, yeah! Oh, I did it! <laughs> yeah, the ground's missing there. Yeah. Press the action button. Press the action button. Oh. So as you can see, the uh, Saturn wasn't really a, a 3D console, it was really just 2 Stand next else. to it and press the action button. Some doors can be opened this way. Reed is standing next to the door you just opened. Now go find him. He's right next to the door. <laughs> well done, rookie. I wish there was kind of like some background music. Okay. Stuff. Yeah, there's, there's, it's, it's really room. weird. Hey man, you, now, need, you, need this, you need this to train, train, man. You oh, can't oh, have it's a very important. Crystals are concentrated forms of energy. Using its energy, 
Our suits generate a shield which protects us from all fire hazards. It's like rings. Uh huh. Oh, it's like Sonic. Yeah. Okay. Who made this game? Now collect all the crystals in the room. Yeah. Also, that's Star Fox. That's a Star Fox. That's straight up Star Fox. Is there? Yeah. I was like, uh, excuse me. <laughs> Well done, rookie. Just don't well reuse. Done, you can't just reuse the sound file well for that. Hey, they just have a room that's on fire just for these occasions. And our newest member. Hi, I'm Sean Mabarney. Yeah. What? What? I'm, a, what? I'm sorry. Say that again. <laughs> I'm a Barney. Yeah, I don't. That's what I heard. <laughs> uh, that's basically what happened. He was like, huh? I'm just gonna write this. Your that's your name now. Here, I'll show you how. Why does he sound like Sonic? <laughs> the pulse laser absorbs the flame's energy and transforms the energy into crystals. Ah, oh, is that what's the happening? Shield increases with each crystal fire is energy, so. so it's a very good <laughs> idea to collect as many so we just crystals as possible. Fire. Now it's your turn. Put out the fire and collect the crystals. Put out the fire with your gun. Yeah. Oh, they're gonna run straight into it. I was like, <laughs> no come on! Firefighting is a fundamental part of your job. Always try to extinguish any fire that you can. You'll be able to recognize the intensity oh, no. of fire by its color. Red flames are weak. Generally, one shot will extinguish them. Weak. But the blue flames, which you see there, are much tougher to put out. Several shots from your pulse gun are needed to put these flames out. So be careful when you see different colored flames. Next, let me introduce you to the laser blast. Press and hold down the action button for a few seconds. Then release the action button. This allows you to discharge a very powerful blast. Look at the gauge at the oh, bottom of the screen charge. to monitor your charge. Oh. Release the button when the gauge is full. Remember the time that Sonic totally like, beat yeah, Sonic fine. without his charge shot? Laser blasts are extremely powerful, but remember crystals cannot be formed when hit with them. So keep an eye on your energy level before using a laser blast. Use the laser blast to put out so the don't shoot the crystals because you can kill them. <laughs> Silas, you can do better than that. What? I shot the. Oh, I missed that. No, you gotta time it better. Wait, I didn't time it right? Yeah, like as soon as the gauge goes up. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I guess he had nothing to say about that. Okay, let's go to the next room. <sighs> Cool okay, cut. now how to pull off an evasive maneuver. Before an explosion occurs, you'll hear a whistling sound. If you press down on the D-pad before the explosion, you will automatically avoid the blast. Reed will demonstrate this for you. <laughs> he messes it up. Watch carefully. <laughs> Chillis, it's your turn. <laughs> okay, so fun fact too, if you mess this up enough times, he just eventually gives it up anyways. Not that bad. That you can Not bad at all. Let's we'll keep going. <laughs> keep going. Okay, this is the last part of our training exercises. This is the last exercise, oh, the most body. rewarding part of our job. The rescue and transport I thought she said the most boring part of our job. <laughs> it's pretty basic. All you need to do is walk up to the survivor. The most important thing to remember is that you need to have at least five crystals in order to generate enough power to transport the survivors. Okay, let's try it. So damn, if you don't have the crystals, you just leave them to die. Yeah, you can't transport them. Well, sorry man, I, I, I didn't get the crystals. I, I, I gotta leave you here, man. I, 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 I want to help. I need crystals first. I go just go! Shh, shh, shh. Look, see your trans blood. Oh, that's why it's fucking magic. Yes. I thought it gives you the power to, like, pick him up. I thought that's no. what they were saying. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm sure. Well, you'll be okay. Look at your polygon butt. Wait, so you expend crystals? Is that true? Yes. To teleport. So yeah. actually... Oh. So you're, not, you're not lifting him physically. So if you have ten crystals and you extract somebody, and then now you have five. Look yes. at that! But if you get hit regardless, you lose all. She looks like a rejected Logan Crisis like character. Yes. I love so it. It's like Sonic. It's like Sonic. Yes. I just like her a lot. Chris to all rangers, 
First mission, fallen memory. Out of four missions, too, keep in mind. Whoa, 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 whoa! You just jumped into the ball of flames! <laughs> Didn't you hear the whistling sound? I guess not. Also, keep in mind when that uh, green bar goes all the way down, uh, there's gonna dead. be a lot of there's gonna be a lot of explosions around you, so just avoid this. But you can fill up that green bar by exploding fires. Going through that door. The fire is spreading faster than I thought. Chillis, be careful. I'm here to save you. Hold on. She does sound like Ruby. She sounds like Ruby. I know. I was like, like Ruby Rose. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Why is Ganondorf here? Listen to her voice. Coordinate set. Coordinates confirmed. Transport. Oh wait, so I need a nine for this? It takes all your crystals. Transport complete. Oh. You need a minimum of five. Yeah, minimum of five or it'll take all. The all right. green crystals give you five. Yeah. So, I, so I'm gonna complete the map. Like, just gonna be branching past. Yes. And Chris will tell you where to go. Oh. When it branches. Oh. Ah ha! Ah ha! Ah ha! You're learning. Chris, give me Chris. You'll be able to go from there. It does a slight auto target, yeah. Okay, that's good. So I thought I had to get the and there are bar bosses in this game too. There are what? There are bosses in this game. What? I had to fight an explosion? Go on. <laughs> Go up. Did you ever um? There was a movie called I think Backdraft where it was a sentient fire that was destroyed. Wasn't a sentient fire? <laughs> that's what I thought it was. No, no. it's not. <laughs> Literally, Backdraft is when like. So what happens? And if you ever went to Universal Studios and teach you about this. What happens is when there's a fire and like you open a door, it, well, causes, yeah. ox it causes oxygen to en to go into that area, and that's what causes a explosion of fire. Well, no, I get that, but I it thought the movie sentient, it's, no. no, I thought the movie itself was called was um was just there was a sentient fire that was no. attacking the whole thing. No, I know because I know what like that no. is, but freaking, I thought that's what the whole movie was about. No. <laughs> Damn, that sucks. <laughs> I thought it was like Netflix tier, like fucking rubber. You ever heard of rubber? Yes. Yeah, I thought it was like that. The serial killer fucking tire. Yeah, but, but no. <laughs> With psychic powers. Let's take water crystals. I just saved Nancy Keaton. I had 19. No, no, it was 19. Okay, you had 15. So it took 10 that time. Yeah, I keep thinking jump is. But um, the, the, 19, the 19 total was because you use 9 to rescue the last person, and you use 10 to use this one. So you, in total, to save everybody, you use 19. Also, there's a door to your left. Ah, there is. Yeah, right there. Looks like a shutter won't budge. There should be an emergency override switch nearby. Try locating it. Here it is! <laughs> Tillis, Sector D-101 has an elevator leading underground. Head towards Sector D-102 with plan site located. So when I first started playing this game, the first thing I did was walk in that first room, I saw a fire and accident and ran right into it. Because I hit the wrong thought I would. Yeah. Well, no, I actually expect you, I have a little more respect for you. Do you? Gotta go back. Oh, you can't, you can't go back anymore. <laughs> and if you don't know where to go, I think it's the... Mavericks. Yeah, the top one of the... This is yeah, Turn back. You can't go there. This is Tellus! Go left. I 
I'm pretty sure this is the other button do? Does um, she say um, something else? No, she just says. Keep moving forward. Okay. That's cool. But yeah, this, as I said earlier, it has a voice navigation system, so you have to use the voice. On the central horn, it's just a piece. Show, why are you transmitting my coordinates? Hey, this is my sector. What are you doing here? Relax, Mr. There are an injunction that overlaps sectors. Fine. Fine. Also, watch out. Watch your, yeah, watch your gauge. Yeah, your gauge is getting pretty low. Yeah, I know, but I don't. Go up from there. Whoa, whoa! It's on! <coughs> Calm down, it's okay! You're dead! You can't believe my eyes! <laughs> what? You can count on me! Coordinate set! Coordinates confirmed. Transport. The machine near you. That actually does sound like a I know, right? <laughs> Well, it's, it's not, not her. her. Yeah. It can't be her. You have to remember this game came out in like 97. When this game came out, she had to have been like maybe 12 yeah. or 13. That's the wrong way. What? But crystals! Well, stay. It's up there. Don't go back down because it is up on the But it's on the end of the floor, I think. Go up from there. Oh, it's yeah. in higher. Yeah. Oh, I see. Transmission from like Peppy Hair or something like that. Good <laughs> <laughs> luck. coming up and down, I thought that I was like shutting some lights. There should be an elevator directly in front of you. It will take you underground to sector D-103. Look for the elevator hallway. This is bad. I found the elevator. It looks like it still works. I'm heading down. Roger. Chris! Keep moving forward. Uh, uh... Yeah, you don't want that gauge to go up. Be 
The inner shut are opened. Let's go in. Oh, uh, the building's at like 44%. What do you cut out fire at your gauge? Keep that down. This is Tillis! Oh. Give me a calm down, it's okay. Calm down. <laughs> Why? Why is this happening to me? <laughs> well, lady, okay, everybody else is just relax. Right? I'm here to Jeez. save you. Any Connery. Coordinates set. Coordinates confirmed. Transport. So it only takes about ten. Transport complete. Ten from you. You're doing yeah. fine. Okay. Am I? Um, I need more. <laughs> I, I, need, I need help. You need to go up, I think. This is Tillis! Give me a second. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure you need to go up. Listen for any sounds. They'll help you avoid explosions. So the other way. Turn around. Go back that way. Take a left there. Good job, Green. Of course. Chris, the energy generator just kicked in. Central meter just canceled. Yeah, locally. What's this? I'm getting 
So fun fact, yeah. this game was actually a prototype for Sonic Country. Really? Yes. Huh, is this why it does it, it controls less than optimal? Yes. Uh, <laughs> why not? I mean, I don't mind how Sonic Country controls, but yeah, this is... Uh, oh yeah, that was your first Sonic game. <laughs> that wasn't? No, was it Sonic? No. no. Wow. Does this seem as Sonic game <laughs> <laughs> I actually played Sonic Adventure after Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is, isn't it basically like the whole Alex Kid thing again? Alex Kid? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Alex Kidd. Like, Alex Kidd was a game. Alex the Kid? No, it's called Alex Kidd. Yeah, no, I have it. But people didn't know that. People thought it was called Alex the Kid. Why do you think Sonic became the mascot, not Alex Kidd? Because <laughs> he has thumb. So how do I destroy this thing? The thing that's clearly spewing the fire. Oh, wait. You don't need to go that way. Oh. You don't need to go that way. Fine. Yes. <clears throat> What's making this so flammable? Jesus. Yeah, exactly. Who would design a building like this? One that could just like... Be on fire constantly. Oh, yeah. Explosion is gonna go during this cutscene. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, you can't outrun that. 